Now for some divine guidance with John Clark and Brian Dore. Tony Abbott, thanks for your time. It's very good to be with you, Brian, and thank you for inviting me on the program. Absolute pleasure, Tony. Mm. You've uh, taken some criticism uh, this week from your close association with uh, Catholic Archbishop George Pell. Well... The primate. Well, we're all pr in this together, Brian. Um, this is not something I run away from. I've known Archbishop Pell for a very, very long time. Yes, he's, he's a friend of mine. And I do yeah. see him regularly, yeah. yes. Every two weeks. Once a fortnight, Brian, yeah. yes, I do. Why do you do that? I mean, isn't this why people see you towing the line of the religious right? Well, Brian, I do it because I sometimes find that I happen to be in the area. Every two weeks? More so or less. Just pop in. Pop in, Brian, yes. And, cup of tea. Uh, cup of tea, a little bit of light discourse. What do you discuss? We discuss plenty of things, Brian. Two men discussing things in a manful way. And, uh, like what? Oh, independence of thought. Really? How to eliminate that. Yeah, and women? Women, what to do about them. Yeah. Plenty of issues, Brian. We go right through quite a lot of issues. Does he advise you on matters concerning your portfolio and health? Well, that's a good question, Brian. I think on a lot of these issues, his views are quite well known. The views that he makes no secret of his views, I think issues they are quite what? well known. Like, like well, what? you know, like independence of thought, for example, Brian. Really? How to eliminate mm. that. And women? Women, what to do about women. Yes, yeah. on those issues, I think his views are quite Plenty well known. Issues. Mm. Do these statements Archbishop Pell has made this week about the religious consequences of people not voting the way they're told. I mean, well, Brian, look, be fair, this after all is actually the role of an archbishop in society. What, making ridiculous threats? Well, no, 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 Brian, offering spiritual guidance, Brian. I would have thought particularly on issues of this importance and this sensitivity. Well, what, what important issues? What sensitive well, issues? independence of thought. Right, I see. Well, how yeah. to eliminate that? And women. Women, there's your trouble. What are we going to do about them, Brian? Yeah. These are questions uh, which I think we can take guidance on. Do you think religious leaders should be giving advice in this way? Other religious leaders? Yeah. Brian, as a general rule, I think religious leaders should perhaps keep away from what might strictly be called the political model. Mm. Um, it's just that in certain instances I find what Archbishop Pell has to say absolutely sensible. But it you don't agree with him on everything. Sense. No, no, no. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be advocating that everyone else do it. I just think that in a couple of instances he makes perfect sense. What is it? Independence of thought, bro. Of course. How to eliminate that. And women. Women. What are we yeah. going to do about women? Plenty of issues there, aren't there? Plenty of issues there. Tony bro. Abbott, thanks for your time. Something burning, Brian?